More and more states are lifting their mask mandates in schools, but California is not following suit just yet. The CDC says it's still too soon, but there's debate among health experts. Our ABC 10 News anchor Derek Stahl is going in depth on the metrics these experts are looking for when it's safe and how California stacks up. California is one of 13 states with a classroom mask mandate still in effect, but more than half of California's counterparts have already announced they'll lift those requirements by mid-March. I'm okay to lift the uh, mask mandates in school. It's not going to impact the infections in school. Epidemiologists are split. If we do this too soon and without certain metrics in place, we're going to find ourselves on a roller coaster of outbreaks and then reintroducing mitigation measures and then rolling them back again. There are lots of studies showing masks in schools make a difference. Last year, a study on Arizona's two most populous counties found school districts without a mask mandate were three and a half times more likely to have outbreaks. Another report found pediatric COVID case rates were 50% lower in counties with school mask requirements compared to those without them. But all of these studies were done on the Delta variant, not Omicron. Schools are not an entity by themselves. Schools are part of the community. University of Washington's Dr. Ali Mokdad says California's strategy to maintain mask requirements in schools but remove them in public places doesn't make sense. If you start looking at the school separately from the community, you're not going to do it right. And we need to be realistic. Kids live in a community. They don't live in a school. His group estimates 73% of Americans are now immune to Omicron, either from boosters or infection. And they argue it's safe to lift mask requirements everywhere. But other experts argue that schools are unique places because so few children are vaccinated. This week, researchers at Harvard released a study where they modeled the impacts of lifting masks in schools. In a hypothetical elementary school of about 700 students and teachers, they set a goal of allowing no more than 10 new cases per month. They found that if 25% of students were vaccinated, along with 70% of teachers, the elementary school could safely remove their masks when the daily case rate in the community reached 14 cases per 100,000 or less. California appears to be right there, with the exception of its case rate. Last week, it was 38 cases. This week, it's down to 18. Derek Stahl. ABC 10 News and Governor Newsom says he will lay out the timeline on when school mass mandates will end. That will happen on February 28th.